I've had lots of big orange deliveries, which can only mean one thing. New Timu, what I ordered versus what I got. Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new Timu, what I ordered versus what I got. If you are new around here, I do these videos every single month. I've got a full playlist, which I will leave listed down below, where I scour Timu for the best deals, the questionable items, and just stuff that honestly makes you go... Are you serious? Timu is an online marketplace, but I love shopping most on their app. You can download the app and I have a 100 pound coupon code, which I will put in the screen here and down in the description box. Timu also offers 90 day free returns. There is free shipping over a certain amount. I think it's 10 or 15 pounds. And they also accept Klarna and Afterpay, so secure payment methods. These packages couldn't have come at a better time. These are all the summer picks that I found on Timu, things you didn't know you needed for this season from questionable designer accessory dupes. I scour Timu and find the best bits so you don't need to waste your time doing so. If you like this kind of content, I would really appreciate a big thumbs up and hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell to not miss any of my uploads. As I said, I do at least one Timu video every month so you won't get bored around here. Right, first item. I have been waiting for this to come back in stock. How cute is this bag? Honestly, they do them in so many different versions, but I thought that you could couldn't get any more summer than this. Gotta say, it is smaller than I was expecting. In fact, it's a lot smaller than I was expecting, but how cute is that? You just don't see this in the shops. I'm not sure it's gonna fit all of my SPFs because I tend to have a bit of a collection. <laughs> but actually, do you know what? No, it's really wide, so it's actually quite short. But how cute is this? They did ones that said beach. I think they did ones that say swim, bikini, mum. Like there was just a bunch of different summer themed things. And it's got this sort of like raffia at the top. Okay. This was not this size on the listing. For once, usually when you order stuff from Timu, it comes a lot smaller than you expect. But this has come a lot bigger. I ordered this necklace because I thought it was very cute for beachy summer season. You're gonna hear beachy in summer, those two words, a lot in this video. But it has arrived and I don't think I'm gonna be wearing this. This is what it has come like. Now don't get me wrong, it is absolutely stunning. It's just massive. I've got necklaces on now, but do you know what I mean? If I was wearing that, do you not think that looks a little bit unproportionate. Excuse my nails, I am getting them done for my holiday literally tomorrow. It is a stunning shell and they've even got these gold accents on it. It does look like really well made, the shell. The chain is just, you know, a very cheap chain. I expect that to make your neck go green. You could take that off obviously and just use the charm if you've got a nicer necklace that you want to put it on that you know doesn't make your neck go green. But it's just really big. I don't know, does that look unproportionate? Can you let me know in the comments? Because I genuinely don't know if this looks right or not. Oh, okay, let's just jump straight into shoes. So I spotted these sandals. Now, Timu is a fantastic place to get shoes. If you watched the last Timu haul, I think it was, I picked up a really good pair of sandals for summer. But I got these and they did them in silver, gold, and rose gold. I nearly went for rose gold because I think the gold looked a bit too yellow gold and it has come and it is quite yellow. They're just a gold sandal, but you you know, when you compare it to prices like Primark and stuff, you're not really paying. In fact, Primark's getting a bit expensive now in the shoe department. So actually, I think these were a little bit cheaper. So these look like a good size. I upsized to 41 in these. I'm a UK six, which I think is a 39, but I went upsized to see if they'll fit. Yeah, so I've just literally slipped them on my feet and they fit like perfectly. So in terms of what I ordered versus what I got, definitely upsize on these. Okay, so I got Andy a really cute little set. So we're going away obviously on holiday like I said and he kind of struggles with the Hawaiian print tops like any of the boyfriends in the back, girls who buy for your boyfriends, husbands, whatever your partners. Uh, I don't know about you but in the shops they're either like really loud prints if you want those Hawaiian shirts. They're just really colourful and loud and that's not really something that Andy would wear. I found this set on Timu though i never think to look for men's stuff but actually guys there is a like, humongous amount of really nice stuff for men so this is what has arrived and i love the look of the shirt let me see though oh yeah okay this should be a good size for him how nice is this 100 percent. i know he'll wear this on our cruise it's just a white shirt with the beige palms but it feels pretty well made and it's one of those it's quite thin but 
that's good. Like that's a good thing for summer um, holidays. And then it did come with the shorts, but I wasn't really interested in the shorts. I bought it more for the top. Okay, this is cute. So I went on H&M recently. I did an H&M haul if you want to check it out, but they have got some stuff in for summer. And one of the items I bought was a big gold shell earring. That was $3.99, I think, but I spotted this one on Timu, which I actually thought was nicer and it was cheaper. And this is what arrived it's just this textured starfish and i just think that's adorable i really need to start wearing clips more i kind of don't want to put this in my hair because i feel like it's gonna ruin my hair but how cute would that be just you know plumped on the side oh no i've done it now uh, okay that's fine maybe like over here like you know like tucked in the back or on the side like that could be really cute i need to learn how to style clips but that especially with brown hair like it stands out a lot as well oh okay not <laughs> not summer themed to the video we'll just pause on that a second but i love timu cards you know i pick up the novelty cards when i see them spotted this one and i just thought it was really funny i've got a few um men in my life who like whiskey and i mean i pictured this for like my granddad i just thought it was a, a really nice card the only problem is it has come a bit bent they're just blank inside but i love novelty cards like this and so cheap on timu <gasps> I forgot I ordered this. This is um, another questionable item that you will 100% know the logo when you see what they have tried to print on here. Canvas bags are really handy for summer. So I ordered this purely because I was curious if it was going to have a full logo or not. This is what has arrived. Again, it could do with a little iron, but um, I can confirm it does not fully say the brand name that we all know it's emulating. Is that even the address? I mean, I don't think so. I mean, <laughs> can somebody let me know? Three Rue Dil Mer Marahuan? Marahuan, that sounds like somewhere in like Hawaii. Ooh, this is cute. Okay, country, country fans, country style fans. I did just pick up this because I thought it was adorable. And it's got arrived. I've got no gold Western belts, only silver. So I got this one. The buckle is really big, but I actually like that. And then it's got the finishing up here as well. So that is gonna be cute for my country festival. What's next? <laughs> Dupe after dupe after dupe. Honestly, what product am I gonna choose for the thumbnail? Because, okay, all right. The Oran Sandals by a very, very, very well-known brand uh, have been duped left, right, and center. Whenever I go into Primark, I show you them. I, I swear even like Georgia Asda, like all the like supermarket brands even are jumping on them. Timu, of course, have got a variety to choose from. I spotted these ones on Timu and I went for them because they not necessarily looked the most similar. They certainly don't. You can see they're very, very different to the actual Oran sandals. They have the inspiration there though, so you can see that they were trying to dupe that. But I bought these because they were extremely cheap. Very, very cheap. And I went for white and this is what has arrived. These actually look like a well-made sandal. Yes, yeah, see I got these in a size 42 apparently, but I'm looking at them right now. I'm like, no, that is definitely a UK six. So that's like upsizing by three. So just so you know, if you order them, they did them in a bunch of colors and they have got this sort of like croc effect on them. Uh, but this is a really nice soft bit of like fake leather. Obviously it's white and it's square toed. And I mean, ev just everyone's got these and I just thought they'd be quite nice for holiday. They are very comfortable. Also, I'm really sorry. I'm not doing any cutaway clips of trying on the shoes because I haven't had my pedicure yet. Again, like I said, that's tomorrow. So sorry. I'm actually gonna keep these on because they're actually very comfortable. Um, apparently, I ordered another pair of shoes. I really should exercise some self-control. Oh my gosh. These are stunning. I remember now, I I nearly didn't buy these because they were like, I think they were like 15 pounds. They were a little bit more expensive. Um, no, these, 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 wow. Um, they're not heavy as well, which is what I was worried about because as we all know, weight, luggage, Stunning. They've even got the gold all within the jute here, like threaded through. And then what I love the most is you have got this absolutely liquid gold metallic straps on them. And then you've got long straps again. What size did I get these? A 40. Okay. Now see, these actually look like they're going to be quite big. So I, I'm, I'm just going to say it with Timu with shoes, you don't know where you stand. <laughs> 
no pun intended. You just gotta order it and hope for the best. And don't worry, like I said before, if they are the wrong size and you need to return them, there's 90 days free returns. So it's it's not a problem. You can go ham, order a bunch of shoes, return the ones you don't need. What I love about platforms as well is you get kind of the bouginess and the like, I've dressed up, but without having to be uncomfortable. What's next? Okay, this is a travel essential that you will need if you love your bling. I'm just a little bit extra, so when I've seen this listing on Timu, I've seen these atomizers before, travel atomizers, but I mean, no, you don't want a simple plain metallic one, of course you don't. You need a full on Swarovski version. This is actual sort of like Swarovski looking crystals. I mean, you can see that. These aren't plastic. They are glass. There is not one missing on here. How long it's going to last, we will see. This is beautiful. It just is the container that is uh, bejeweled because there you go, you can put your um, fragrance in there. How do you put it in though? Because aren't you supposed to pump these in? Okay, so <laughs> the other ones you used to have something at the bottom where you just pump it like in your fragrance thing and it just pumps it in but it looks like this you're literally just gonna have to spray in the bottle uh i don't care though for the price and for that how bouge that is what 10 out of 10 for me on this one <laughs> oh dear right i think i've done pretty well so far i do you guys I'm, do you think like honestly i sit there and scour timu to get the good stuff so you guys can just click the links down below if you want to shop another country style item are these gonna fit oh i think they might you know i couldn't not get these because they're so unique would you see them anywhere no uh so i massively upsized on them i think i got a uk 18 or an xxl uh, and they look like they're going to be fine but i couldn't not get these cow print denim shorts shorts they are so cute and if you watched the last Timu video you'll know I got those earrings with the cowboy boots that have this print on them and I also got the hat so I feel like this is going to be a full long road at festival day outfit I'm not going to leave you hanging anymore what I probably plan to put in the thumbnail is this huge designer dupe accessory a very classic summer accessory from a brand that um make the B very iconic and their brand may start with G and sound like Pucci. <laughs> this is the blurred item that I would have put in the thumbnail. I spotted this on Timu. They had loads of variations of them but the B summer hat is so popular. I will put some photos here of people wearing the real thing. Uh, you know, it's very iconic. They do lots of different versions, but this one comes back every single year. So when I seen this Timu listing, I had to grab it. And this is what has arrived. So green, navy, burgundy, and cream. And then of course, the bit that is non-deniable is the iconic B. So you can fully get that Gucci look <laughs> on Timu. I, um, yeah, I didn't really want to do that because I'm probably going to flatten my hair now, but oh well. I don't think I'm a hat girl, but I really wanted to give it a go. What do we think? Again, it's a little bit misshapen from being in the packaging around here, but uh, yeah. There you go. I can't wait any longer to see this dress. So I had to order this. I only ordered one fashion item. I get a little bit bored with fashion stuff on Timu, if I'm honest, like watching people, so I don't order them that much. But hold, hold on, because this is what I ordered. And I, I, I'm going on a cruise in a couple of days. And honestly, this item, I could just picture wearing on the top deck for a beautiful photo by the pool. I had to order it in a size 16, I think it was. I ideally would have gone for 12 to 14, which is the, the medium, I think. But I went for the 16 because it's all they had left in stocks. So I'm keeping everything crossed that it's the right size. This is what has arrived. I was fully expecting this actually to be worse quality. Oh, that is going to be borderline. This is stretchy, so I think it may sit a little bit gaped on the back, which is what I was worried about, which is why I wanted to go true to size. But we will see. I will do a try on clip for you, of course, but oh my goodness, you couldn't get any more I'm on summer holiday look. I'm on summer holiday. This is adorable. I can't wait to try it on. And look, that necklace. That necklace with it. I wish it was a bit smaller, but please stop no i didn't apparently i ordered another pair of shoes it ain't my fault you know i do these things late at night oh <laughs> another amazing find yes well done honestly like i can't get over 
how cute these are. I absolutely love sandals with loads of like jewels or crystals or embellishments. I had an amazing pair from River Island years ago and I think they set me back about 45 or 50 quid. I say me, I think my mum bought them for me back, that, back then. It was years and years ago. I feel like any high street brand, chuck on a pearl, chuck on some rhinestones and they just increase the price by like 30% if not more. So I was on a bit of a mission to find a style like that on Timu and I succeeded. I came across these on Timu and this is what has arrived. Look how unbelievably beautiful these sandals are. The only thing I'll say that's letting them down is that this um, material is rose gold. I think it would have looked a lot nicer as gold because there's actually gold within this embellishment. But let me come up and show you the detailing on this. I love pearls on a holiday. Again, it feels very mermaid vibes. It feels very by the sea. Uh, so yeah, I think these are gorgeous. Like I said, I am just a bit disappointed that this is rose gold. I got these in a 40 as well. And again, these are looking a bit small, so we will see. Oh my gosh, they'll actually go with that dress too. I mean, any of the shoes I got today will go with that dress to be fair. I am so sorted. I gotta start packing after this video. I think I bought these in the first Timu haul, but I picked up another set for myself and Andy. It is just the luggage tag. I got them for my mum and dad last time, but I got a little beige one for me and a little black one for him. These are so affordable and so cute. What is this? Oh, okay, so I trialed another makeup item dupe. So this is what I picked up. I thought that it was, you know, that that element looks a lot like Fenty. I'm not massively familiar with Fenty Beauty, if I'm honest with you guys. It's not a brand that I've ever shopped at. I think I have the highlighter from them, Trophy Wife. But I'm always hesitant of buying off-brand makeup, even in the shops, if I'm honest with you. But I wanted to give this one a go. This is definitely Fenty. I'm just gonna pop the product that I know on screen here, so you can see. This is the one that I recognize and probably why I recognize this product because let me show you. This is what has come. Look at, <laughs> look at that writing on there. Beautiful element with the um, mirrored top and then of course here is the actual product. That's interesting, that applicator. If anyone's a fan of the other brand, let me know if that's the same. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. It's almost like a, like a thicker, like mousse paste. Ooh, ooh, I mean. Okay, no, I don't feel it's that impressive. I thought it would be like a proper liquid rose gold, but it's not. Well, no, from a distance, it looks really, really nice. Definitely like a natural glow. The only problem is when I was kind of blending it out on my hand there, it kind of felt a bit like it was clumping a little bit because it's that mousse, it's not a liquid. Oh, I got another, I thought this came as a pack. Oh no, I must have got this separately. I picked up another star clip, but this one's a little bit more understated and it's got the pearls on it. And this one is a, a crocodile clip as well. The other one was a different clip, but I mean, this is 100% gonna get caught in my hair if I put it in, but you know. Cute practical purchase alert, but uh, I picked up this multi-pack on Timu of thongs. Whenever I go in pri into Primark, where I usually get my underwear, they're just always sold out. I know all my Primark fans will fill me because the underwear section is very difficult to navigate. But this just looked like a really good set with it all being different natural colors with the browns and the beiges and stuff. So yeah, they've come. They're almost like a no VPL as well. well that is that bag done. Now on to the next bag. This haul so far has got me so excited for holiday. Day. Another practical purchase, but for travel, uh, we've all got to have a luggage strap. So I picked up a lovely aesthetic beige one because I feel like you only find these in bright colours. Um, so actually, I was excited to just have a beige one. Another piece of jewellery. Now they really sell me on the listings. So this was the listing. Never would I ever wear a, a necklace kind of like that white, this white beaded bit but they just sold me. It's come really well packaged actually to stop it getting all tangled. But yeah, again, it's one of those, you'll probably get a few wears out of them, but it's fine, you know, for the price, it's no different than buying fashion jewelry in Primark. That is so lovely. So you've got the starfish on the long white one. You've got then the shell, what is that? A palm tree, and then a little emblem at the bottom. This, these chains are very, very light, um, but I just think that that could be a, 
Oh, that is love. You've got to admit, especially with a top that's cut like this, you've got to admit that that is stunning. And I think this is the final piece of jewellery that I picked up. I'll just get through them quickly. I love a little charm bracelet, and I spotted this one for it was very summery, and I wasn't wrong. Just a bunch of gorgeous shells and pearls on there. This is very lightweight. This is very much uh, fashion jewelry but again i think this one was like two pounds maybe i want to bring back charm bracelets like do you know they just they're so like 90s to me i never really wear fashion jewelry unless it is summer because i love all of this stuff i got these passport holders to go with the luggage tags and i quite like them because they match as well so like the luggage tags are the same colors so andy and i can have the black and beige they're lovely again i got them for my parents and they've been using them so i highly recommend Something for the house now on Timu. I spotted these coconuts. You could make the cutest cocktails out of these. So it comes as a pack of two. I don't remember how much these were now, but we've got a garden bar. And I must admit, I am partial in the summer months to like a Malibu and pineapple juice. Like that's a really good combo. ASMR. Love coconut shells planking together. They are very different sizes, but that's probably because they are actual raw coconut, obviously. They've got the base on them as well, and I just think with, you know, your little straws, your little decorations, you could also make a really cute little rum cocktail or something in them. Oh, this is cute. You never really see silver. I didn't realize it was silver. One more piece of jewelry, uh, this necklace, and it has come, and it is quite different. It's got these like neutral starfish and then the silver beading on it. I thought it would be gold beading, but this is very cute. This reminds me of that necklace that Tiffany and Co do. It's not duping it, I would, it's just probably inspired by, but it was like the X one. I think someone on Love Island made that one famous, but this is kind of like the beach version of the Tiffany necklace. It's a bit weird to see it with silver. I feel like with gold, it would have been more summery but actually it's a nice refreshing change and finally we are finishing on another duped item i've had this in my cart what feels like for months so i recognized the logo and i thought it would fit perfect in this video for because it is a raffia so i spotted this listing to any of you who are familiar with the brand anim bing uh, then the logo might look familiar to you. This is what has arrived. I ordered it in cream because I just thought it looked really fluent with the raffia style here. Uh, but you can get it in the brown and I think black as well. It's a good strap like this, but can we please take a moment? You cannot deny that that reminds me of the AB there. I'm not sure if they actually do a bag like this, but the logo definitely caught my eye. Uh, and yeah, it's got no pockets or anything inside, but it definitely is a dupe. Right guys, that was everything in this Timu summer what I ordered versus what I got. I think I picked some great little accessories here. Let me know if you've got any holidays planned this year, if you plan to get any of these items. Don't forget about that £100 coupon code I've got as well. I'll pop it on the screen again here for you. I'm also going to leave some videos in the screen if you want to check out some more of my content because I would love to spend some more time with you. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to make sure you don't miss any of my uploads. You literally make my dreams come true. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in one of these videos. Ciao!